Hey guys, Zadman. Today I'm going to be showing you the Kodak EasyShare C533. It came out on February 17th, 2006, and I got from Goodwill's online auction store. And it's a pretty sad camera because, well, what makes it sad is that I can't use, even though it says that it supports AA batteries, AA batteries don't work with it for some reason. However, if I take this off, Kodak's proprietary rechargeable batteries, they work with it just fine. So at least I can use the camera. I think the reason why AA batteries don't work is because right here, I think there's like a, like a piece of metal missing. I'm going to turn on the camera. And now it's on. Anyway, here are some test pictures, some test videos I took of this camera. Here's a test video for the Kodak Easy Sierra camera. And right now, it's the trees and the bushes. You hear the birds chirping. Anyway, so I'll say for now. Bye. All right. Here's a test video for. The 320 by 240 resolution for the Kodak EG Star camera. And right now, you can see the trees and the bushes. You hear the birds chirping. Anyway, so I'll say for now. Bye. Anyway, here are the little buttons. There's the D pad and the OK button. There's a share button, there's a delete button. This is for turning the HUD and the display on and off. 
This is the menu button. This is the review button. On top is the, the self timer and the flash. Right here is the wheel for choosing modes and the star button. And this is where the SD card goes. And also a, a port for the for the AV out and proprietary USB cable. And right here is the the DC port, I can't, which I can't get to work, even though I have a have a have an adapt have a power cable that fits and shakes the right amount of voltage. And right here is a WNT that's for zooming in, zooming out, and the train train for you right now. You see the lens moving. Let me go to the menu. You can set the exposure, compensation, and the picture size to these modes right here. The white balance, the ISO speed, the focus zone, the color mode, long time exposure, Set album, image storage, and, and here's a set menu. There's live view, camera sounds, all power off, date and time, video out, orientation sensor, date stamp, video date display, language, format, and about is the firmware version. Now if I go into movie mode, you change the video size to your 640 by 480 or 320 by 240. And also set the set album and all. It has some features. And with the set menu is basically the same as the camera mode. Anyway, so I'll see you for now. Hope you enjoyed it.